We have got an absolute treat here. Marco Simone, off the back tees. We're gonna do, we'll do six foot gimmies. We'll be a bit generous. Um, greens, let's go 10, just slow them down a little bit. Give me more of a chance. Um, we will go back tees. Weather, we'll leave it at that. Actually, let's get some course level altitude in there. Won't make much of a difference. Should we get a little bit of wind? And that should be all good to go. Marco Simone. What a starting hole. 433 yards. Part four. If you didn't know why I'm so excited for this one, this is the Ryder Cup venue. So all of these holes that you'll be seeing, you'll be seeing the top players in the world play. And um, let's see how hard Marco Simone is off the back tees. I'm gonna go with a seven, just so we get it past that flag stick. Good start with a par. Not bad. Never ever complain with a par at the first. I've pulled the big dog, but oh, this looks like a very interesting hole. Very interesting hole. Have a look how far we have to clear these bunkers on the left. That looks like it's maybe just doable. So, hopefully, if it goes just right of them, should be fine. right of them. It's a good bad one. It's a very good bad one. <laughs> so it shows you, it drops all the balls around the hole and it'll just show you where they're feeding in. So just short of it looked like there was a bit of a slope. That changes my club. So now instead of looking to fly it past it, obviously we know just short of it there is a bit of a downhill slope. So we can go with an eight iron Get a little bit aggressive on this one. Not bad. Go on then. If we hit it. Still never complain at a par. That's two pars to start. Two pars to start. Four, six, one. Looks like it's dog leg right. I think we can take drive around this corner. Should be able to. We've got two, five, nine. What can we get a bit further up? 280, okay. Should be absolutely Perfect. It is. Tremendous. Three out of three fairways. Let's check the green, shall we? This is what it's meant to do. There we go. And look, it's quite flat around it. Maybe feeding in off the back, so we can be pretty aggressive here. Does it need to go a little bit or is it good? Ooh, it's a good shot. And there we go, we're in the red. Round Marco Simone. Off the back tees. Beautiful little part three here. Beautiful hole, 187. Down the hill. Look 
looks like there's a bit of a slope behind that flag, doesn't there? Let's have a little look. I love this feature so much. So yeah, there's a little slope there. We can see it all feeding in. You know where to hit it. Oh, just stayed there. Try to draw that in. Keep going. Feel like we're going to hold one in a minute. Feel like we're going to hold one in a minute. Oh, ho, ho. do we have a go at this green? Do we have a go? I think it's a little. It's a bit out of my reach. I think. What have we got up the right here? Yeah, I mean we've got 330 yards up the right there. I think this is going to be a hole where you'll see a lot of different plays and um, certainly for me that is not in reach. Mr Rory McIlroy may be having a little snip. Should be money. Should be money on that centre line, lovely jubbly. Great yardage, just a touch right. You can't leave them short. You can't do it. You cannot be doing it, Josh. I should have got 11 on the stim. My fault. Right, 380 yards. Two back-to-back -back short par fours there. This one looks like we can get a bit closer. Quite low, but it's down the middle. Not very long, mine, but we'll take it. <laughs> Lovely. Oh, broke loads. We've missed some chances. Missed a couple cuts there, we're still in the red. Okay, here's a golf hole. Holy. 210. Uh oh. Uh oh. Get lucky, get really lucky. Ooh. I'm gonna see some short game. 24 yards. Go on then. Go on. Close. Sometimes you just have to ram it in there. Lovely jubbly. No pictures on the scorecard. And here we go. Par five. Good chance here. Beautiful. Beautiful. Good shot. Just a little bit low, I think, with that flight there. We're just looking for a good speed here, really. Inside that dustbin lid, the old saying. 40 feet. It's got to go. It's got to go. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Stay up. Oh, not a free putt par. 
may hurt. Them ones disappointed. We've let some shots go here, but we're still in the red. We are still in the red. Okay. Par five. Dog leg left. Hopefully driver's just short of this trap. Hopefully driver's just short of this trap. Beautiful. We are on the brink. 260. Playing up seven now. In between a little bit for me here. But a smooth freewood should be quite nice here. Fly it. Oh, it did. Oh, I'll tell you what, that almost worked out very well. Oh, sit, 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 sit. Stay in there. Thank you. Okay. Two under after nine. On to the back nine. 450, looks like a toughie. Go. Go. Very lucky. Very lucky. Travel. Travel. Didn't need much more. Go. And that'll do. In for the bar. Okay, short par four up the hill here. Now this is one we will see some driver action on for sure. I think it's only about, yeah, look, 270s in the front. Playing 10 yards up, so still playing 280, but for them big boys, that's only a freewood. Should have gone a little more left. That was good. 27 yards. Oh, it stopped quick, didn't it? Come back? Maybe not. Okay, it's another par. Ooh, beautiful golf hole. Dog leg to the left. I feel like we see some short shots hit into here. Oh, I've tried to draw it. Tried to draw it and it faded. Soft. Okay. Needs to carry. Kick left. Kick left. Oh, I've seen the slope there. Oh, that was close. Delightful. Stay in it. Delightful chip shot. It's going to be three under. Quite a nice round of golf so far. Short par three up the hill here. One five one. 
Beautiful little golf hole. Travel. Travel. One yard. Uh, oh, I don't know how it stayed there. Quick. Hit your putt before it starts rolling back. Quick. 21 feet. Five inches up. It's not bad, it's a path. We will take it. We will take it. Oh, 14. Wow. Wow. That looks like a tough one, doesn't it? Okay. That looks like a tough one. 301 to the end here. Okay, I'm going to leave that as the line and we're just going to try and hit a little baby drawer off of it. If it travels, almost, almost. Go. Delightful golf shot. <laughs> Is anyone uh, giving some putting lessons? I'll take them, please. Right, three under. Still three under par. Tough hole, this one. Wow. This looks like a tough one. Okay, good drive required. This is certainly one you need to get the drive away. Oh, is it missing it? Miss it, miss it! Oh. Let's check it out. What slopes we got going on here? Oh, we've got a nice one at the back there. Okay. Kick left, kick left. She goes. Three holes left. Three under par. Wow. What a golf hole. What a golf hole. Now, what have we got to the front? We've got to go for it, haven't we? We've got to go for it. Oh dear. Oh dear, that's quite bad. That is quite bad. Sit. Okay, had to take the medicine. We found a um, we found a line, and hopefully we can just make up and down for the par. Stay in it. Lovely. We will take the par and run. Take the par and run. That was a poor, poor tee shot. 204 yards. Tough part three here. Is this a six or is it a five? That was tough. That was tough. Ooh. 
thought we had one. It's going to be another par. Can we go round Marco Simone? Bogey three. I've said it. I've said bogey three. Normally what happens now that you've said it, you'll make a bogey. But we've got a par five, so I'm hoping that means a birdie. Done it again. I've done it again. Oh, it's safe as houses. Or is it? Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dearie me. Okay, the saying take your medicine comes to mind here. Just got a seven iron. Stay short one. Sit. Uh, not bad. Oh, it was close, wasn't it? That pin was really tucked. Oh dear! Oh my god! Oh my god! I've got a putt. Oh no! Oh no! Hold this one for the bogey three. Seven feet looks a tiny little bit right to left. We're going to bash this one in, ram it in there. Bogey free. Okay, that was Marco Simone off the back tees. Really good round of three under par. Pretty solid, had a few leaky drives at the end there, unfortunately, but you know, that's golf. And um, hopefully that gave you a good insight to uh, what Marco Simone will hold for this week's Ryder Cup. So if you did enjoy that, please be sure to like and subscribe. Shout out to Foresight for hooking me up and I'll see you all for the next one.